Hey guys, it's Scott here from International Safety. And what we're going to do today, we're just going to show you how to do a manual calibration uh, on an MSA Altair 4XR monitor. Uh, really, you don't need that much to do this. Uh, makes it easy to do it in the field, uh, in a vehicle, or on the go, however you need to do it. All you really need is A, your monitor. You need a calibration cylinder, for gas calibration cylinder. Your fixed flow regulator with your calibration cap that comes with your monitor. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna start this monitor up. And then what I'll have to do while that's doing this thing there, I'm just gonna attach the fixed flow regulator to the calibration cylinder. So what you wanna do before you do that, just always make sure that your fixed flow regulator is off, otherwise the gas will start flowing right away. Um, and also make sure that you do have calibration gas in the cylinder as well. You can see it on the, the dial here. All right, so what we're gonna do, so we're gonna push and hold the down button to start our manual bump test. You'll see it's asking if we wanna do a bump test here. Push the middle button to accept, and then we'll add our face clip to the monitor. So just make sure there's three tabs on each side of the monitor itself where the face clip does lock into. You just wanna make sure that it grabs on all three of these little tabs here. One, two, and three. The monitor here is flashing saying we're ready for gas. So I'm gonna turn my calibration cylinder on and then gas will be applied to the monitor. And you'll see the values will change throughout your bump test, basically showing how much concentration of the gas is hitting the sensors inside the monitor. We should soon get a pass. And then what we're gonna do, we'll turn our fixed flow regulator back off, remove our face clip, and you'll see the values should start to come back down here now. These three, these three are gonna hit zero your O2 sensor should come back to 20.8. What it did there, so because I, because gas was flowing through the monitor itself, basically all you wanna do is just, hit, if you hit the up arrow at the end of that bump test, it will reset your alarms while those values come back down to zero, but always make sure your values do come to zero and your O2 does come to 20.8. And that's a manual bump test on the MSA Altair 4XR. Uh, everything you see here, is available on our website. We'll link all that in the description below. Um, and if you have any questions, concerns on bumping your monitor, please reach out to us and a qualified member would be happy to help. Thanks, don't forget to like, subscribe. Um, and we look forward to seeing you next time.